Hi guys, it's Kendra. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hi, I'm Kendra. If you're old, what is up? So for today's video, I am just going to be... It's like a girl talk kind of thing. I'm not sure. Like, advice for young teens. So if you guys like the video, give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe and press that bell to get notified every single time that I post a new video. Don't forget to go follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Kendra underscore Schwing. Well, let's get on with the video. Okay, so the first one is basically girls will be mean and there's honestly nothing you can do about it. Everyone around that age 13, maybe 12, 13-ish, uh, grade 9, freshman, whatever you want to call it, basically they're all going through stuff, they're all changing, they're all moody, they're going to be mean. So don't worry too, too much about it. Um, this next one kind of somewhat goes along with it, kind of, I guess. Friends will come and go. Um, you're not going to stay with the, all of the exact same friends from elementary school. You're going to make different friends. You're going to lose some friends. You're going to maybe keep some friends. I'm not sure. Um, basically none of these things are the same for anyone, I guess. Everyone's different, so, yes. And basically, the next one is, it's okay not to be okay. You're going into high school. Things are going to change. Everything in your life is going to change, and there's nothing you can do about it. So just accept it, I guess. Yeah, you're going to have bad days. You're going to have good days. You might have a bad week. You might have a good week. It changes. You might have a good year or a bad year. It will never be the same. Every... Every day is going to be different. Yeah, Mondays also will suck more than they did in elementary school. They just do. There's just this feeling as soon as you wake up, you're just out of it. Then you go to school. Everyone else is out of it too. It's like, oh, okay. Well, I was going to try to have a good day today, but... And this next one is the right people will stick around. So if they are meant to be in your life, they will be in your life. If they're meant to leave and then come back, they will leave and come back, guys. I know I've said this before. Everything happens for a reason. Like, every single thing happens for a reason. So just accept it. And basically, this next one, your family is going to have expectations. It's hard to describe, but like, do it for yourself. Don't do it for your family. because. In the long run, it's your life, not theirs. Everything you do, you don't have to do to please them. Because you will go off and do your own thing. You're not going to be living with them forever. So, yeah, basically do it for you, not for them. That goes for everybody in your life. Do it for you, not for them. And this next one is they really don't care. Like, not your family, but the people, like, at school. They don't care what you wear. They don't care how you do your hair. They don't care. Also, if they don't like you, they don't like you. If they like you, they like you. A lot, a lot of people in high school are fake. Like, it's insane. School is just different. Um, yeah, and I'm in grade 11, so. And this next one is you most likely will experience peer pressure. At one point in your life, I don't know anyone that's not been to at least one party. Just do what you want to do. Do it for yourself. Don't do it for the people around you. I know I've said that like so many times in this one video, but it's true. And this next one is not all boys are bad. Not all boys are good. I feel like it's also changed now. I hear people getting pushed into the lockers, personally, I never did, but I don't actually see it, so I don't know. High school is nothing like what I thought from the movies. I thought there was, like, a lot of fist fights going on in the hallways during 
like switch when you switch classes or whatever but there's not or like bullying during switching classes there's not that going on in the hallways that I know of because like if you stop in the hallways you're gonna get trampled no matter what grade you're in and the next one is the he is probably not the right guy um you might your first re- I shouldn't say that your first relationship is probably not the one <laughs> my first relationship was unhealthy I completely lost myself he wasn't doing very good either so yeah my first relationship was not good just was not it also communication okay I'm gonna stop with the relationship advice because like that needs to be a whole separate video or this video is never going to end but yeah it's okay if he is not the right guy you will find the right guy you might find the right guy I don't know um still I haven't found the one or whatever but I heard people not high school but like online and be like I just knew when he was the one but it's like that's crazy to think because I thought he was the one and he obviously wasn't and this next one is periods are natural don't be afraid of it if somebody wants to bug you or bully you about having a period they can grow up because it's normal it's natural and honestly going along with the one that I, they don't care like you don't pay enough attention to people to care and then the ones bullying like if you're getting bullied they're insecure they like you're good you're fine like everything it's their problem you're not the problem they are okay and also at my school some elementary school every teacher said take advantage of when we give you like test reviews or whatever like study sheets or whatever because they won't do that in high school they will i think i have gotten a review for every single test since i've started high school i'm pretty sure if not you just kind of look through your notes it's not that hard but like yeah i've gotten 99% of the time i have gotten a study review whatever you want to call it and also another high school tip i have for you guys is take career work exploration what for my class there was like maybe 10 and then by the end of the semester um there was three of us left every other student dropped out but basically it teaches you about the workplace yes it is just volunteer but like it teaches you how to work it teaches you different environments and i just suggest it because eventually you're going to have a job most likely and you just need to it's just that extra little bit of experience i took it in grade 11 and i'll take it again in grade 12. at my school you can just take it in grade 11 and 12 but there's you, the grade 10 class but you just take both of them in grade 11 so yeah then there's two grade 12 classes so yeah i suggest taking that class and the, the next one is basically just be yourself because like why change why be unhappy so that other people aren't jealous of you i don't know like just be yourself because like your happiness is the only thing that matters should matter to you like i know that sounds like Like, very self-centered. I don't know. But, like, just be yourself. And this next one is don't fight for friendships, for relationships, for things that are just meant to leave your life. Because I have so, so many different times. I have put all of my energy into relationships, into friendships, into just relationships that shouldn't have been in my life. Um, I have put all of my energy into it and just don't and the next one is treat other people with respect treat other people how you want to be treated 
but like like there's two ish main groups and there's the popular kid which is like three quarters of the school and then there's the nerds or not nerds because they're not school booky whatever they're the they're the weird kids like they haven't treated like they're the weird kids so then they just become the weird kids and it's just an, an ever ending cycle so yes just treat everybody with respect if you guys like the video, give it a huge thumbs up, subscribe, and press that bell to get notified every single time that I post a new video. Don't forget to go follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Kendra underscore Bye, guys. Love you.